welcome, welcome, welcome back to another edition of Shondo on the Go. I'm here at Citrix Synergy, made my way over to the Microsoft Windows Virtual Desktop booth, and who do I run into but my good friend, Peter Wiglevin. Peter, welcome. I am so excited to talk to you because I've been hearing so much about WVD. And I'm like, what is WVD? What is WVD? That's a great question. Windows Virtual Desktop is a combination of uh, entitlements and then true technology. Okay. So for example, if you use Windows Virtual Desktop, you get Windows 7 with three years of free extended security updates. So when it goes end of life, you can, if you use Windows 7 on top of Azure, yep. as part of Windows Virtual Desktop, you can use it until 2023 and still get security updates. So that's, that's one thing. Yep. But then we also have true technology which is, for example, Windows 10 multi-session, which is Windows 10, but it allows multiple people to remote into it, which gives you a great end user experience, you know, the same look and feel, and you have modern apps, and uh, we also made investments in Office, so Office just works like expected, like yep. it would on a physical device, and then there's much more, but you know, there's, there's many things that make up Windows Virtual Desktop. These are just a few. Okay, so Windows Virtual Desktop is a Windows 10 desktop experience but it's not on the physical endpoint device. It's actually running from Azure. Windows Virtual Desktop supports multiple operating systems. It supports Windows 7, yeah. uh, Windows 10, just single session, you know, enterprise that you're running on your device. Okay. Then Windows 10 multi-session, that's what we're showing here as well. Yeah. Um, but it also supports Windows Server. So if you are running Windows Server today, yeah. and you want to lift and shift that into Azure as part of Windows Virtual Desktop, you can. All right, now let me ask you this. Microsoft announced the public preview a little time ago. Yeah. When do you think GA will happen? You, Just between us. The yeah, camera, no we'll shut the cameras right? up, we'll no edit this listening. out. Right. So in that case, I'll give you the exact time. <laughs> no, it's H2 of this calendar year, okay. so the second H2 half of this calendar, calendar year. year. But right. you know, don't wait until we go GA, because yeah. you can already spin up things right now in public preview, and once we go GA, you don't need to change anything. You don't need to redeploy, you can just, you know, yeah. go straight off with whatever you have deployed. So don't wait, okay. start deploying today. They go to where to do that? You know, there are several ways. Uh, we have getting started documents. Okay. So if you just search for Windows Virtual Desktop and Azure, that's your first hit. That's probably okay. the easiest. You can also go to aka.ms forward slash WVD preview. Okay. And that will get you to the getting started documents. Okay, now let me ask you this. We're at Citrix Synergy, Citrix and Microsoft 30-year partnership. How does WVD play with Citrix? What is Citrix's role in this? We discuss the entitlements that you're getting with Windows Virtual Desktop. Mm -hmm. On top of that, we have technology like FS Logix. So we acquired FS Logix because it makes Office work just like you would have on a physical device. So that's stuff you can, you can use. But Citrix has been investing in this space for a long time and they have a lot of added value. I'll give you an example. Okay. One of the questions we're getting a lot is what about hybrid support? Because Windows Virtual Desktop that Microsoft offers is Azure only. Everything's on Azure. Yeah. So if you have a workload running on-prem, we can't help you, but Citrix can. Okay. So if you take WVD with all the added benefit that Citrix offers, you can also have a, a hybrid workload. Yeah. So, and there's you know a lot of other things like the protocol that Citrix is using is better in, in high latency, low bandwidth situations. Right. That's just a few, but there's, yeah. there's more, a lot of benefits they okay. offer. So weaving together Microsoft Citrix to give customers the ultimate experience, the ultimate flexibility, and the ultimate in security. Exactly. But Peter, we've been ignoring the demo that's been happening behind us. What is going on here? What are we seeing and what are we demoing? What we're showing here is Windows 10 multi-session. Mm -hmm. So we connected using Citrix technology. We made it into the virtual machine. And this is where we're showing Windows 10 multi-session. So multiple people can remote into it. We yep. can actually see it by launching Task, Task Manager. We're also showing that in a non-persistent environment, Office works just like it would on your physical device. But to me, this looks like just a Windows 10 desktop that I'm running on my laptop. But exactly. you're telling me this is, this is actually running right now from Azure on WVD with Citrix 
but it gives me just what I know as a Windows 10 desktop with Office 365. That's, that's no the difference. beauty. That's the beauty of it. It feels and looks and smells like Windows 10 yeah. because it is. Yeah. So you got your modern apps, you got Office, and what we're showing here is actually the browser. So you know you got clients for all major operating systems, including an HTML5 compatible client. Yeah. And that's what we're showing here. Yeah. So all you bring is a browser and you get access to your Windows 10 device and multiple people can do the same on one VM, okay. giving you a cost benefit. Right. It's just like my grandfather used to say, if it looks like Windows 10 and it acts like Windows 10 and it feels Probably like Windows is. 10, it must be Windows Virtual Desktop with Citrix apps and desktops. Your Amen? grandfather was ahead of his time, absolutely. All right. Now, I'm all in on WVD with Citrix. Where do I go to find out more information, Peter? On the Citrix website, you can actually find, if you go there, there's a link that points directly to Windows Virtual Desktop. That's the easiest. Okay. There's a getting started guide. There go, go there and knock yourself out. Yeah. All right. I'm going to come at you from left field with one random question, Peter. Are you ready? Yeah, surprise me. If you could identify with one Avengers character, which one would it be? <laughs> I have no idea. Probably after four days being at this conference, the Hulk. That's probably what I look oh, like. Hulk? Okay. Yeah. So I think after a couple of days, that will be the most identifiable character. I like it. I like it a lot. I think I'm Captain America because I'd like to have that shield in front of my stomach. Yeah, you got the muscles. It. Yeah. You got the muscles. <laughs> oh, you're very flattering. All right, Peter. Hey, thank you thanks. very much for being here. I appreciate that. Again, Microsoft Windows Virtual Desktop with Citrix Workspaces. That's the way to go. From Citrix Synergy, I'm Shondo on the go. We'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.